Blessings and wholeness, family. One love. What's up? Just Tree here. Hope you're having a beautiful day. A beautiful day. I'm having a beautiful day. It was a real nice day in the garden. Just got home. About to have some breakfast. It's 5.30. Doing my usual 23 hour a day dry fast. And juicing for an hour. Uh, and so tonight, I'm going to have me some mango juice. Just, just some. Mm, uh, juiced mango with some coconut and a power shake with uh, goji berry calendula and uh, what else did I put in here? Uh, Self heal tea. And I'm gonna have a lemon lime uh, mushroom elixir from GT Dave's. And I have a little bit of mimosa bark hawthorn fragrant rose tincture I'm taking. And a little red red ginseng and some seaweed snacks. So coming up next month will be I think three years of dry fasting 23 hours a day and juicing for an hour. So excited about that. Uh, exploring with doing some 48s uh, periodically. I was going to do it every week but I think I've reformed that intention to uh, between one and four times a month. I'm going to do two day dry fast. So that's intention. I just want to speak forth into creation and practice, um, uh, you know, as I move more into breatharianism. Could this man hold the key to survival under extreme conditions? Pralad Jani has been described as a hermit who claims to have wandered around India's jungles from the age of eight and not eaten or drunk anything for nearly 70 years. His claims are now being put to the test. A key Indian medical institute is observing him in a private hospital in the western state of Gujarat with already astonishing results. That we are all watching a miracle in the science or biology so to say because it's already 108 hours since Mataji's admission into this hospital and he has not eaten anything, he has not drank a, a little drop of any kind of liquid but more importantly he has not passed a drop of urine or stool. And that yogic exercises meant his body has undergone a biological transformation. Studying him could allow scientists and doctors to understand better how to survive without food or water for long periods, perhaps even help in exploring the universe. India is now proposing to have uh, missions to moon, manned mission to moon, and in the long run to Mars also. So how people can survive? This strategy, if you understand how people are surviving without food and water, that may help us in working out strategies for making people to live without food or water for longer duration. Johnny will be under observation for a total of 15 days. He claims he was given the gift by the Hindu goddess Amba and the